The Romance of Betty Boop is a Betty Boop short film from 1985. It's directed by Bill Melendez, written by Ron Friedman. And we have a voice cast, including Desiree Goyette, George Went, which makes me very excited, and uh, other really talented voice actors. The voice acting, very good, no problems there at all. However, I didn't really love the narrative, and I was a little bit disappointed by this one. It's produced by King Features, Lee Melendez Film Productions and Bill Melendez Productions and being a big Peanuts fan, those names definitely mean something to me and I was expecting something really solid. And unfortunately, I thought it was boring for two reasons. The first reason is the narrative is just very, very dull. Well, three reasons. The second reason is that a lot of the characters are boring. Not Betty Boop, she's absolutely fine, but a lot of the supporting characters are really dull. And the third reason is that the colour palette is not that fun. And obviously that alone is not a reason to dislike a film, and obviously a lot of the early Betty Boops were in black and white, but I just found it to be visually not very engaging. It's not badly animated, but I didn't find it to be fun to look at. Betty Boop, well, it's all about Betty Boop and relationships. It's set in the 30s, and she's a performer, and then we have various characters who want to try and romance her and i won't say any more than that i don't want to give away too much considering the whole thing is about 25 minutes i will say the pacing of the narrative is okay i don't have any problems with the actual pacing of events absolutely no issues there i just found it to be really boring so it's not bad in the sense that Everything makes sense within the context of the story and everything flows well enough and the pacing is okay. But because it is very much driven by the characters who are attracted to Betty Boop and I found the characters to be very boring, there wasn't really very much in this that I liked. Did I like Betty Boop in this? Yes, sure, absolutely. I don't have any issues with her, but it's definitely not my favourite version of Betty Boop. But she is recognisably that character which is certainly a, a good thing. But other than that, there's not really anything about this that worked well. I didn't care for it. I didn't have fun with it. I just didn't enjoy it at all. Do I recommend it? If you're a big Betty Boop fan, then I'd say give it a go. You might enjoy parts of it. But if you're not that bothered about Betty Boop, or if you're new to Betty Boop, I'd say don't give this a watch. At least not until you are more familiar with other Betty Boop cartoons, because this would not be a good introduction to the character at all. But if you're already a fan, then maybe it's worth checking out. But personally, I didn't enjoy it, and I really doubt it's something that I would ever watch again. <laughs>